have the ability to add as many pages as you'd like to your website. To do this, hover over the Website tab and select Build Pages. This will take you to your sitemap. This page allows you to add and manipulate all the pages on your website. The folders you create are going to be the main pages that your visitors can access through your navigation on your home page. These pages don't have to show on your navigation, however. To hide them from your navigation, click on the folder, select Edit Folder Info, and choose whether or not you want the folder or page to show in your navigation, and then select Update. To create a new page, you will first need to create a new folder. So click on your website name here, up at the top, and select New Folder. Give the folder a name and choose whether or not you want it to show in your navigation and select Save. All new folders will be located at the bottom of the sitemap, but you can easily move them. Just click on the folder and choose to move it up or down on the sitemap. To create a new page, select the folder, select New Page, Give your page a name, and then give the page a title. You can choose whether or not you want it to show in your navigation, and whether or not you want it to be active. If you choose to make it active, your visitors will be able to see the page when they go and visit your website. If you don't want them to see the page, then unclick the active box here, and then select Save. Once you've created the page, you'll be taken to edit mode so that you can edit the page. For more information on editing a page, please view our Editing a Page video tutorial. As an overview, our editing system is very easy to use. It's just a drag and drop widget system. So to add a widget to your page, select on the widget, drag it onto your page, and drop it. Again, for a more detailed tutorial, view our editing a page tutorial. To view a page and to see how your visitors will view your page, select on the page and click view. This is what your page will look like to your website visitors. To edit your page information, Click on the page, select Edit Page Info. Again, here this is where you can title your page. Title your page accordingly as this title will show up in your browser tabs. Page meta tags are important for SEO, so make sure that you give your page meta keywords. And to do that, select on the page, select Page Meta Tags, give your page meta keywords and meta descriptions and select save. If you want a page to have the appearance of an existing page, click on the page that you would like to duplicate and select duplicate page. Here you can give this page a name, a target subdomain if applicable, and again a title. Choose whether or not to show it in the navigation or make it active and select Save. And this page will be designed exactly how the previous page is, but you can go in and you can edit it by selecting on the page and clicking Edit. Again, you'll be taken to edit mode here. To delete a page, click on the page and select Delete and then select OK. If you delete a folder, you will also delete all the pages that are connected with that folder. To do that, click on the folder and select Delete and OK.